There are many strategies out there for binary options that I personally created and some other people have created, but I consider this to be the easiest binary option strategy for beginners. And it's a turbo strategy that just made me a total of $1,512 in six minutes. And I'm going to teach it to you right now. Hi everyone, this is Christian here on YouTube and welcome to a brand new video for the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how I was able to make over $1,500 with pocket option and give you a full tutorial in regards to this specific strategy. But hey, if you're new to my channel and you're into binary options, forex trading, crypto trading, or any type of making money online, then this channel is for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below and activate the notifications bell icon so that you get a notification of every new video that I upload. With that being said, let's jump into the video. Hey, before I actually jump into the content of this video, I just want to give you a warm invitation. If you're a binary options beginner and you want to get a full free training in regards to binary options, this is the opportunity for you. I'm having the link in the description of this video and I'm going to have a this week, a live webinar where I'm going to teach you all the basics in regards to binary options at no cost at all. We have limited spots available, so I do recommend you to actually go in there actual YouTube channel, uh, the link is in the description and get a free spot for that specific training where I'm going to teach you all the basics in regards to binary options. With that being said, now let's dive right into the content. All right, everyone. So I want to start this video by showing you my live positions, my live trades in regards to this specific strategy. Some of you already know it, but in this specific video, I'm going to give you a full tutorial in case you don't know this specific strategy. But first, let me show you my live trades so that you can see how I was able to make $1,500 in six minutes. All right, so now that you've actually seen my strategy in action, it's actually time to show you how the strategy indeed works. And in order to show you that, let me just go ahead and close the indicators that I have right here. What you need to do is actually start with this broker right here called Pocket Option. And the link is in the description of this video for this specific broker. And you can get a free demo account for up to $10,000 with no upfront deposit whatsoever. So basically it means that 
once you actually get a demo account, you don't need to pay anything and you can practice as much as you want to with this specific broker in order to start making money or getting the experience to then start making money. So I'm having the link to this broker in the description of this video in case you don't have it yet. So let me just go ahead and move my camera. And the first thing that we're going to do is actually change this to candles and then to S30. Okay. Why is 30? That basically means that every single candlestick is going to be for 30 seconds. Then the second thing that we're going to do is that we're going to add an indicator called um, stochastic oscillator right here. Boom. And then another indicator called RSI, which is uh, stands for relative strength index. Now I usually just go in this arrow right here. Let me just go ahead and move my camera and this arrow right here and click on it so that I can see the indicator a lot better. And, um, you can see that there are a few levels right here this level of 80, this level of 20, this 70 and this 30. Um, if you want to avoid any type of confusion, you can just simply eliminate the 50 level and save. That's it. So now we have four levels. What are these levels? Pretty simple. The 80 level and the 70 level are identifying that the price is an overbought condition. What it means by overbought is that the price went up too high and it's expected to have a retraction and start dropping and an oversold level, which is identified by the level of 30 and 20. It basically says that the price it's oversold, which means that the price went down too hard and now it's time to retract and start pulling back up. Okay. As simple as that. So overbought and oversold level, keep those levels in mind. So what the strategy basically does is that it identifies whenever a price of an asset is either overbought or oversold. So what it's looking for is a, a small retraction so that we can make money out of that specific position. How is it that we're going to do it? Uh, let me just go ahead and find a good example right here. I think AUDJPY is a good example. So there you go. We have an overbought condition in this level. Why? Because it went over the level of 80. However, in RSI, we don't need the price to go over the level of 70 in order to be considered overbought. You only need to wait for it to either touch or crosses the level of 70 or get super close to it. I'm going to tell you a few secrets in just a little bit at the end of this video, but just so that you understand like what are the actual settings. Now, when is it that you need to enter the trades? You enter the trades when both of the conditions actually are met. So at the moment that you actually see this, for instance, right here, uh, this right here, take a look. It is overbought right here and it touched the 70 level on RSI. Therefore you enter your position for one minute and then the expiration will be the next two candles. Simple as that. Let me just go ahead and repeat it and get a different example in order to show you what I mean by this. So for instance, this one right here, this is overbought right here and it touched the level right here and it wasn't exactly in this candlestick. So then you enter right here for a position of one minute, one minute, which basically is two different candlesticks of 30 seconds, number one and number two, the price expires right here and you want the position. Okay. So whenever the price over, obviously it's overbought, then you're going to enter for a put position. And when the price of the asset is oversold, then you're going to enter for a call position. Does that make sense? Now, let me just go ahead and share with you a few extra secrets that I take in consideration when I place in my positions and why sometimes you actually realize that I want positions, even though the price of the RSI was not actually touched or the level of, uh, was not actually touched. For instance, this one right here, I'm not sure if I place this position. No, I didn't, but take a look at this specific level right here. Let me just go ahead and get it right. This one right here, as you can see, the RSI did not touch. This one was overbought. Nevertheless, you could have entered a position exactly in this candlestick and you would have won the position in this level. Now, why? Because you saw that the price, even though the RSI did not touch entirely or did not really touch it, the level of 70, you can, you can see that the, uh, the stochastic oscillator does this movement all the time, right? It continues to do this. 
So whenever the blue line is crossing the red line, it basically means that there's going to be a put position going down, of course. And when the opposite happens, it basically identifies a call position. So what we're looking for with this extra secret is a prediction of what's going to happen within the next few candles, even with the RSI not touching the level. So here you can actually enter the position, even though the RSI did not touch the actual 70 level and you still won the position. Now, obviously this is just slightly ad uh, advanced um, than the you know the regular strategy but what is this tweak going to do it's going to give you more entry opportunities and it's going to give you a little bit more of accuracy if you actually consider both of uh, the factors going on right there you can see that i was able to win three positions only and i stopped so my advice with this specific strategy if you already won three positions stop if you already won two uh, four positions stop and if you win three out of four stop that's a 75 percent accuracy you're gonna start making a lot of money all right fifteen hundred dollars in one day of trading is not bad at all and today's monday which is a crazy day to trade it's a little bit more volatile so why would i continue risking my trades and as you can see i started my first position at 1628 and my last position was at 1634 so six minutes it took me to make fifteen hundred dollars with this specific strategy now before i actually finish with this video um in case you didn't know now you can actually try trade live with me here on youtube how can you do it there is a button below this video that says join and if you click on it you're gonna display these options which is 249 uh, $6.99 or $9.99, whatever plan you want to choose. Every Thursday at 15 GMT, I'm going to have an exclusive live session with you guys here on YouTube. And a lot of people are already uh, attending these webinars or these live sessions and making money out of it. So for $2.49 or even the highest, which basically just makes a few differences. There are, there are the features right there when you actually click on them. But whatever um, price that you want to pay for, two dollars and 49 cents it's super cheap per month for having live sessions with me which i should have charged like hundreds of dollars a month but no you will be able to do it for two dollars and 49 cents we're gonna have a great time every single thursday at 15 gmt so if you want to join now is the time to actually do it the invitation is right there hey so hopefully you enjoyed the content of this video and if you did smash the like button to support this youtube channel and more importantly if you have any questions or comments to share make sure you leave them in the comment section below and my team will be happy to reply to you but if you in case haven't subscribed to this youtube channel and you want to see more videos just like this one hit that subscribe button below thank you very much for watching this video and i'll see you on the next one